Good evening. The SNP is investigating two complaints of inappropriate conduct. It comes after the First Minister said Parliament should be prepared to confront any allegations and proposed a cross-party review. In the House of Commons, UK ministers pledged action within days after allegations there. Where our political correspondent Nick Hardley is in Westminster for us this evening. Nick, what more do we know about complaints involving the SNP? Yeah. A charity is to combat fake news about cancer on the internet by appointing a full-time nurse to provide accurate information. Macmillan says unverified sites are causing unnecessary worry. It's created the post based in Glasgow to provide information about cancer through social media. Katie Hunter reports. An ambulance technician told a murder trial he thought it was odd a toddler was lying alone when he and a colleague responded to a 999 call. There are calls for the Scottish Government to take over the running of NHS Highland following a weekend of protests over the downgrading of services in Caithness and Skye. Hundreds of people took to the streets of Wick and Thurso where hospital services are being reviewed. Jackie O'Brien can tell us more. Football now and the man in charge of Scotland's future strategy hasn't ruled out taking over as manager of the national team. Malky Mackay was given the job on a temporary basis for next week's friendly against the Netherlands. Might he take the job on permanently? Alistair Lamont has been asking the question. Well, now let's see what the weather has in store for us all. Christopher? Jackie, thank you very much indeed. Thank you, Christopher. And that is Reporting Scotland. We'll be back with an update. Our next bulletin is during breakfast at 6.25 tomorrow morning. But from everyone in the late team, good night.